every job we take, we make some new friends. We get the ball, we score the goals, and then it's on again. Maybe tomorrow we'll get a brand new start. Until tomorrow, the aim is he would park. Well, folks, welcome back to yet another episode of my Football Manager 22 Game Safe with <coughs> Blackburn Rovers, boys and girls. Blackburn Blooming Rovers, that's right, won the journeyman. Uh, the season is dwindling down to the final four games. Uh, and you can catch all four of them right here, not today. Uh, you catch two of them today, two of them tomorrow. Uh, but we're still sitting seventh. Uh, we are five points off of a European spot. I don't know. I don't know how we managed to do this. Um, but we're grinding out the results. It's not been as free flowing as I was hoping for. But we're still in the, in the discussion as well. We're taking on Watford today, 16th. Also taking on 17th place. So back-to-back -back wins there. And you never know, boys and girls. And then we'll end the season tomorrow against Everton and Chelsea. Chelsea, of course, uh, sitting high in sixth spot. That's the one we want. And hopefully, if we can come into that, to that game tomorrow within three points... It could be all on the line. It's the way days, though. It's the way days. Anyway, let's bring you up to date with what you missed. Of course, last time out uh, in Rovers, guys, it was uh, the draw against Burnley, which is very, very frustrating. But we can all celebrate because they have been relegated. We will not be playing them again, probably, ever, unless we get them in the cup. Anyway, we took on Fulham and we won 2-0 at Ewood. Uh, Jones for the penalty spot, giving us the lead on the 42nd minute. Uh, then we uh, made sure of all three points. Crow from the corner. Headed that bad boy home. 2-0. Job done. Scrappy result against Norwich. 1-1 uh, in the end. Uh, we took the lead. Schlickling lobs it on forward. Jack Mo getting his first goal for the club. Top left-hand corner. But, Davish getting a, an equaliser. A bit of a floaty left at there. Uh, who is Is he on, on loan? £20 million English fella. We have actually got Baker on loan from these bad boys. £20 million squid a ruse. I'm hoping we get some money in the summer because we need to invest. Look at the yellows. Look at the pissing yellows. One yellow, two, three, four, five. Oh, goodness me. Yeah, too many. Then we brought back to Ewood. Uh, one more draw against Brighton. She say points dropped here, boys. Points dra dropped. Uh, Brighton took the lead through a bouquet. Or bouquet. And Bramado from the bench. Uh, penalty spot. Six of the season. Gives us a share of the spoils. So we're going to take on Watford today, Ewood. Uh, then we're heading down the road to Stoke to take them bad boys on at their place. New glasses, can you tell? Okay, folks, they're taking on uh, Watford today at Ewood Park. Now, we played each other just the one time, and they won. They beat us at Vicarage Road probably early in the season. I can't really remember it. Uh, anyway, we come into this in OK kind of form. A lot of draws knocking about. Uh, unbeaten in five. Watford, just two wins at the past. Five as well, it looks like. Um, so, yeah, win for Watford, currently find themselves in 16th. They could shoot themselves up to the dizzy heights of 12th. And a win for us, if I can scroll back up, keeps us in at least 7th spot. We've actually played a game more than Wolves and Chelsea, so uh, it's not great. Chelsea taking on Leicester. Hopefully, uh, hopefully they can do us a favour, because realistically, uh, it's, I think it's a bit too much for us to get into that 6th spot. This is a crazy. It's 7th place at the moment. That's well ahead of expectations uh, for us um yeah let's go so here we go boys and girls we're actually going to see the debut for miranda he was the free transfer uh, pick i picked up uh back in january he was injured so yeah debut today plays in the middle of the park we're looking for a guy to pull the strings here especially for next season i'll tell you now look at this team uh gracia will be a part of it schlickling will be part of it moriarty will be part of it Hall will be part of the team. Owusu and Textera. The likes of Jones, Giacomo, Miranda, Festa, Cassius. All could be sold as a massive clear out could be on the go. Because I want to kind of kick us onto another level. Boys. Seventh is great. These are work, workman-like performances. Guys that are, uh, are batting above their station. And then if you look at the bench, you like Sir Bramado. I'd like to bring in if I can get him on a freebie. Roberts will stay. Baker's on low. Malik could probably be sold. Low Everton, I'm not convinced. Crow is a good universal defender as well. Could play left, right, centre. So he'll probably stay. But besides that, anything goes here at Ewood Park. Hang on. Hang on. Uh, we're going to go attack him. No, 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 no. We're not. We're, we're going to go positive. We're going to stay positive. Just positive. Alrighty then. Taking on Watford. Um, Greenwood on the right hand side. Of course, they picked him up from Wolves for a cool load of money. And Pandu as well. El Capitano these days. Go. Let's do it, boys. Let's do it. Let's, br let's bring it. Bring it. Rovers. Free kick. Festa. Charlie Festa. Uncle Festa. 
with a with an effort there from the he doesn't he hasn't got many games uh, he's, he's he's worth a bit of money as well i i would sell him just to just to invest i'm just i'm uh, the reason i would sell a bunch of these boys is purely for uh to get the money because we've got none we've got zero i'm hoping the board will dig deep we've got 40 million in the bank i think realistically we need about 60 to uh to kick us on the level so if we do get 30 million we'd have to make up another 30 in sales so but you never know we might pick up some freebies out there we we have in the past uh Textera was a freebie we need a whole bunch of Texteras. anyway hall can he get the cross and he cuts past this man hall was a bargain as well we've just got to hope the scouts are doing their bit and they are they are they've got they've, they've, they've been busy out there sliding tackle can we get the ball back it's long range i can't really see much free kick for rovers 22 minutes down. Let's go attacking then. I think we, we, we've we've uh, given them a bit too much credit here. Leicester 2-0 up against Chelsea. Now we need to do our bit. And get that down. Go on then, son. Owusu. Owusu is a key man. Of course, we can't lose him at all. Unless they offered 50. Somebody offered it for 50 for us. For him. Textera. Can he keep it alive? He pulls it back. Jacobo. Jacobo crosses. It's deep. Oh, it's wide. And Textera can't put it in the back. Hmm. Demand more, lads. Demand more as we edge closer to the full time or half time whistle. It's nil nil. Stoker winning as well. We're not doing the bits. We're not doing our part of the bargain here as we enter half time. It's nil nil. They're boss in possession. Shots, target, everything. They've got it all coming at us. Uh, but yes, Chelsea losing. Which okay, second half, Sondes. Here we go, lads. We are attacking. Here comes Watford with the corner. Deal with it. Deal with it. Headed clear only as far as Green. Not Greenwood, but Green. Oh, it's acres of space. Gracias down to the ground. And we'll save the day. Push it out for yet another quarter. Mandy on this bad boy. Whips it in. Headed it partially clear. Only as far as Nass. Broken up. Giacomo was in there. Bandy still with the ball. Still with the ball. And away it goes. Let's find the winner here, lads. We need to find a pissing goal. Fester. Break it up. Come on, lads. Come on, get your foot in there. Get it. That's a nice block. Who's first to it? It's Giacomo. Giacomo's to it. He's got a man going forward. It's Jones. Lays it off to Giacomo. He can't really get onto it. And it's broken back with favour of Watford. And here they come on their left. Oh, goodness gracious me. Picking up a pass. They're coming down the left-hand side. Still with Watford. Bandy. 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 Bandy goes for a goal. Great save. We've got 52 minutes on the clock. Another chance. Watford. Greenwood. Pings in the ball, a beautiful ball. Bandy still on. He's been a pain in my ass. Great effort over the top. Hmm. Do we? Yeah, we'll see what. We'll see what changes we can make. Jacobo has got a, a thing, me Bob. What's our other formation? Yeah, let's go with this guy. We've got a lot of yellows knocking about. A wusu. Miranda, where can you play, sir? Let's get you up here. Jones. For Baker. Let's bring on Baker. It's going to be Bramado on the left. Not got much pace there, boys. Not got much pace. And we'll bring on Crow. For Fester, get rid of that yellow. And that's our changes. We are going to go attacking. And hopefully, that kicks them into life. Come on, Rovers. Oh, goodness me. They call me the Tinker Man. What a great save there, Gracia. Can we bounce back straight away? Come on, then. Come on, then. Straight from this little bit of possession. Locked forward, picked up by Burmamado. Holds up play. Expertly done. That's his, uh, his wise head there. Over to Mariati. Potential new leader, new Capitano. Hall pulls it back over the top. Mariati picks out a pass. It's Cassius. What's he doing way up there? Oh, tries to get across and it's picked out. Away we go. Schlickling back in over the top. Nicely. Great goal. Sandro Miranda on his debut. Get it up, yeah. Pushes him further forward. Look at that. Alan Hall with the assist. That's why they pay me the big bucks, boys. That's why they pay me the big bucks. Lovely. Schlickling picked it back. Over the top. Picked up by a whole load of little layoff. Miranda, first time strike. 
That's what it's all about. Demand more. That pushes us to two points. Chelsea, they do have a game in hand, but that's fine. Whipped in. Straight at the keeper. Butterfingers. Butterfingers is there. Oh, what a shit keeper he was for us. Uh, for Leipzig, I think it was. Break it up. Break it up. Get rid of it. Greenwood. Greenwood's on it. Come on, Schlickling. You're better than him. Oh, what a reach. Goodness gracious me. It's close. It is close to the money. Come on, lads. Get creative. Get creative. Come on then, man, boys. Come on then. Hold firm. Free kick. Owusu's on it. Oh, straight over the top. Butterfingers was, was big and strong for that bad boy. Straight from kickoff. Goal kick even. Ampadu. Spreads it. We should not be attacking. I don't know why we are, but we are. Nah, nasty, Nias, whatever his name is. Goes for goal long range. Let's change this now to balanced. Show some passion, boys. Show some blooming passion. Let's hold on for the victory. Oh, no. It's down to the last couple of minutes. It's Nias. Pain in my ass. Eduardo sliding tackle. Oh. Oh, heavens, heavens have saved us there. Leicester 3-0 to the good against Chelsea. That seems to be nailed on. Cassius, don't lose it, sir. Don't lose it. Keeps it in play. Lovely, lovely little layoff. To Miranda, now assist maker. Textera can't get the shot in. But that is that. Could it be that? Could it be that? Awusu. Straight at the keeper. Butterfingers, not butterfingers today. Looking solid. I want to check him out, see if he's got any actually England in England caps. Because we sold him to Munchen Gladbach. And then we brought in Gracia at, uh, at Leipzig. And then, of course, Gracia was a bit of a flop. Um, I had to bring in Schlengelar. It's like a vicious circle, boys. This vicious circle. There is Butterfingers. Come on, then. Think about it, son. Think about it. Computer's like, why do you want to look at Butterfingers? Two caps. For England, Watford spent how much? 20 million. 5 million? Ah. Well, well, well. Oh, much like I got relegated. No wonder. No wonder they got relegated. They got butterfingers between the sticks. Anyway, Sandro Miranda, welcome to Rovers. Welcome to Ewood. Three points. So after that match, match day, we uh, currently find ourselves in seventh spot. Two points off of sixth. Um, five points off of fifth. Just saying, just saying. But, uh, of course, realistically, at this point of the season, we're gunning for that sixth spot, boys. We are gunning for that sixth spot. Um, it is well ahead of, uh, of schedule. Did not expect to be anywhere near this sort of standard. Um, to be honest with you, let's just go. Let's just keep on going. Stoke next, who just beat Bournemouth uh, to move up to 17th game. So they're in a relegation dogfight, folks. So it's going to be tight. Uh, who have Chelsea got? Should we have a little look? Who Chelsea have? Or is that going to be... Uh, are we... Uh, just preempting something. They've got Manchester City. Oh, okay. Wolves, tricky, tricky. But they've got Champions League football on the agenda, on their mind. Um, I think they need to lose the Wolves game uh, because I can. I, I think they'll they'll get some results out of these two. Uh, and if we could be in, we're in the driving seat, or at least we will be within two points of um, of them come the final game of the season, then uh, it's all on the table, boys. It's all on the table. They do have a game in hand on us, though, uh, which does suck. Anyway, we'll, 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 we'll digress after the next one. Okay, folks, next up us, it is Stoke City at the bet. Three, six, five. Now, we played each other 23 times. We've won 10 of them. They've won six. There's been seven draws between the two sides. They are struggling at the moment. They are in a 17th spot. We are in seventh, of course. Still keeping an eye on Chelsea, who are in uh, sixth. Mathematically, still, still enough points on the table for us to finish as high as fourth in the table. That's Champions League football, boys and girls. It won't get, it won't amount to that because Liverpool have a game in hand and more. Uh, Liverpool are taking on Watford today. A tricky away days for them. Uh, of course, uh, our eyes or our attention will be at Stamford Bridge to see if Wolves can do us another solid and beat Chelsea. It's not going to be easy for Chelsea, of course. Uh, but they're battling multiple fronts at the moment. But this is it. Uh, do or die for Rovers. If we can win this one here, of course, uh, the result goes our way at Stamford Bridge. Then it's going to set up for a barnstorm and finish. OK, then, folks, uh, today we're trying to find somebody. Can anybody, anybody play on the left hand? In fact, we're going to we're going to start with uh, the way we finished uh, last time around. We're going to go with this formation here. Giacomo is not going to play. We're going to pull him. Uh, we need somebody in midfield. Jones is out. 
Hmm, what's my where's Savina? Savina, you can come in. I know you got I've got I know you got a, a rocket in those shoes. Giacomo, you're gonna come out and we're gonna bring in Lindsay knows where the back of the net is occasionally, so we'll pull bring him in. Romano on the bench, Low Everton as well. I do would like to see him on there actually. So Low Everton in place of Savina for the time being. I think these two could be could be a nice little partnership if, if they got their act together. And then who is who is my preferred at the back here? Once agree playing time. How many games have you played? Just the three, so it's not been you. It's been Crow then, I think. Crow coming in for faster. They are the dream team at the back. Now, what do we have on bench-wise for any injury? So, Fester in the is very, very similar, and is as is Mallet. Um, what about Sassy? Sassy, are you ready? I don't know where you are, Sassy. Hovart, you can come on for uh, Mallet. Collins as well. You can you can be in the thick of things for Myers. In fact, scrap all that. Jones needs to be in the mix. Okay, I think that, I think I think I'm settled with that team. Ah, oh, so we have Gracia between the sticks. Uh, Schlickling left back, Crow, Moriarty, Cassius, Low Everton, Ousu, Lindsay, Marianda, Hall, Texter, Marianda. One goal in one game. Hopefully, you can make it two at Stoke. Let's go. Taking on Stoke, who have Hernandez leading the line. Anyone else? Do we know anybody? I don't think so. Please, let's get a win out of this bad boy. Please. All right. Here it comes. Free kick for Stoke. Over the top. Over the top. Okay. First bit of bit of nerve trying to get that out of the way. I think there's a goal at Stamford Bridge. I don't know if it is, actually. Uh, anyway, picked up by Hall. Pulled back now. Moriarty. We're playing the Blues. Uh, Full-on blue. Uh, here comes Cassius on the right, uh, right back. Whips and across. Headed partially away by Stoke. Smith. Back to Parles. Lumps it forward. Can we get onto it? No. It's Strasbourg on the ball. But Low Everton's trying to dig his heels in. Over the top, picked up at the back. No, Stoke can get the shot off. It's Hernandez. Straight to the keeper, Gracia. And it's been a lively first four minutes. Everton are, in fact, in front. Who are in a relegation dog scrap at the moment. Hernandez lays it off to Mitchell. He blitz past my defenders. I can't believe it. And he goes for a goal. Keeper stretched. And Mariati will see that bad boy out for a corner. Stoke all over us at the moment. They are looking to get themselves uh, clear of that drop zone. Over the top, picked up by Miranda, who just hoofs it clear down to Textera. Can he make something out of it in favour of us? No, he loses possession, and Stoke will get away with this one. Uh, and that's that's your lot. First seven minutes, all Stoke, still all Stoke. And then the highlight coming at us. Straight to the keeper, Gracia. Can we make anything out of this, though? Because that looks a bit tame. Looks like a bit, bit of a tame highlight. Lobbed out to Mariati. Back to the keeper, Gracia. And pushes it forward to Owusu. Playing much deeper than he usually does. Uh, but that's the way we've got to go. Crow. To uh, Low Everton. Miranda to Owusu. Linking up nicely. Over the top. Beautiful pass. Textera. Can he get the shot off? He can't keep a... Uh, is, that, is that twos and sixes or whatever? And then the defender sorts it all out in the end. So far, madness. It's been all madness. It's been a majority of it. It's been Stoke. Um, if it if it remains nil-nil here and nil-nil over at Stamford Bridge, I don't know. I don't know how to if we can get excited about that or not. Anyway, Owusu. That will suit Schlickling. Picks it up on the left-hand side. He's got a yellow. He's got to be careful. It goes in the box. Oh, my goodness gracious me. He doesn't score many, boys. He doesn't score many. So I was thinking if he's going to have a shot, it's going to have to be something spectacular. Anyway, here we go again. Schlickling on the throwing duties. Low Everton. Don't lose it, son. I paid 10 million for you. Still can't believe I spent that 10 million on you. Over the top, lovely Schlickling. Picked up by Owusu. has got not got many goals until today. He makes it his third of the season. Just his third of the season. Playing deeper. And that is what it's all about, boys. We've got to demand more, though. We can't just sit on this 1-0. Uh, but Owusu picks it up. And that puts us in to seventh level with Chelsea. Owusu. Oh, good. Oh, there could be a penalty in here, boys. There could be a penalty. There could be a penalty. And it's Moriarty, the centre-back, is taking the penalty. I don't believe this. Who in the right mind has decided that centre-back should do it? He does know where the back of the net is. Take it all out. Delete the comments. Whatever. Moriarty, centre-back. Fifth of the season. He's got more than a Wusu. I don't believe it. The flipping goal-scoring centre-back. The Charlie Mulgrew of Kosovo. 2-0 up, boys. 2-0 up. Goal difference is still way not in our favour. But as it stands... It's looking good. Owusu. Why is it in? Can't get on to the end of it. And here comes Mitchell for Stoke. 35 minutes on the clock. 
They're bombing down the left-hand side. My, my, my defenders are tracking back. Can we get the cross? Oh, lovely. Look at, look at Lindsay. But he gave it also a bit of a mess there. He got he got, got the possession. But it was a bit of a mad dash scramble there. And here comes Stoke again with Redmond to somebody out to left. And it's Mitchell cutting inside. Loves it off to Hernandez. Goes for goal. He tucks it in there, man. It's 2-1. Shit. Schitzenbergenhofen. Schneiderlingen. Uh, okay, that's turned the game on its head a little bit. We have not switched up to, to attacking. We're still on positive, which is great. We've got another level. Wolves are winning. Wolves are winning. That's pushed us into six. I can't believe it. I can't believe it. I don't even know. I can't I can't get excited because I just don't think it's going to remain. It's 2-1 to us at half time. It's 1-0 at Stamford Bridge to Wolves. Get in there, boys. Liverpool are winning. Who's the six? Who's the... Who's the it was the fourth place team, I don't know. But uh, realistically, let's just focus on what we got in front of us. Win here today, and then we'll see what else has gone on the, uh, in our favour, if anything. So, here we go. Second half, Stoke straight from kickoff. I don't like this. We need we need that illustrious third goal to make sure of the spoils. And here comes Stoke, breathing down our next on the right-hand side. Limanga pulls it back to Atamatadis. Hernandez, decent striker, puts it wide. Liverpool 2-1 up. Liverpool are the fourth place team, so... It's looking overly ambitious. Anyway, Grassi, whoever that is, that uh, was their goalkeeper, punts it forward, and Hull got his head on it. And they can uh, stoke once again with Mitchell. He's been very lively down that left-hand side. Broken up there, lovely Miranda. Can you make it a, another uh, eventful day for you? Lobs it over to the left-hand side. Beautiful pass. It's Lindsay. Doesn't get much credit. But there it is. It's Ricardo Textero with the third goal for Rovers. Goodness me. 14th of the season. Alan Hall... Woo, what a pickup he's been. He's been an absolute revelation. Miranda, though, with the vision to switch it over to the left-hand side. Lindsay, though, kept it alive. Look at that. He's one-pegged, look. Right-footed right, right cross on the left. Eventually comes out to Hull and then Textera. And that smashes that bad boy home. <gasps> I can't believe it. I really can't believe it. It's Oh, it's 2-0. It's 2-0 on Stamford Bridge. It's all working out. All we've got to do is just win the remaining games. And I think... We will be in Europe next season. Low Everton with the straw. Oh, it's four. It's filth. It's absolute filth. Low Everton's got his third of the season. He's not been as good as I'd hoped he was, but he has been a workman and in turned in the performances just like this one. Uh, Sonny Low Everton could have even relegated Everton. Uh, maybe, maybe. I don't know. I don't know if he has. But look at that, Perla. Look at it. It's 4 1, lads. It is 4 1. And I think that's. A comfortable scenario, just enough to bring on Junior Bramado. Where you, there you go, let's stick you up top so you don't have to do much running. Um, Roberts will come in for Hall as well, and then we'll even chuck in Sean Collins for a, a bit of a cameo at left back, just to get rid of that yellow card. It's looking solid, guys. It's looking absolute solid. We've even we were actually in the plus goal difference for the first time this season. Four one with the Anuosu. It's gonna. Uh, uh, is that in? Oh, we might. Stop it. Stop the play. Stop the play. We have to get into the penalty taking things and then get my main man on there. Get him on there. Get Bramado on there. Go on, sir. Go on, sir. Go on, sir. Go on, Bramado. Go on, Junior. Good on there, my boy. That's what I'm talking about. Seventh of the season from the bit part player. Junior Bramado knows where the back of the net is. Knows where the back of the net is. 5-1, lads. We've absolutely ripped him a new one. And there's me panicking. Panicking Skywalker early doors when they took the lead. Uh, yeah. Happy days for that. Happy days. Two points off of Arsenal in fifth. Six points away from Liverpool. Still mathematically possible. But, of course, uh, ain't going to happen. Ain't going to happen. Wolves are 3-0 to the good. Chelsea are absolutely shell-shocked. And here comes Stoke. Uh, I don't know. I'll, I'll let you... I wouldn't even be asked if he scored this one to be honest with you because we are so far in front and that is a Bobby Dazzler Raphael Luongo uh, gives them something to get excited about it's probably too little too late we're actually going to play cautious now just to just to be sure of it and there's no extra drama actually pushed us in is it on, on level goal difference once again here comes Stoke a third will piss me off a little bit Oh, my goodness gracious me. Daniel Hernandez has made this an eight-goal thriller. I can't. I, don't do anything stupid now, you clowns. You've got five minutes to see this out. It's two goals from Chelsea. It's all gone absolutely bedlam in the last few minutes. got five minutes of stoppage time. Do not do this. Do not even. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. Bramado, hold up play. Excellent, excellent. Moriarty pulls it all the way back. 
to uh, Gracian. Lovely. Skins two Stokies there. Crow to Low Everton. Lobs it forward beautifully. Excellent control from Lindsay. Pulls it back. Time for another shot. Low Everton's fourth of the season. It's six on six on the day. 6-3, Bobby Dazzler. That's your goals, lads. That's your goals. You can't complain with lack of goals, lack of drama today. Even on cautious, straight from kickoff. We've still got four minutes of stoppage time. Is there another, another twist to the tail here? Luongo's already got one, Bobby Dazzler. He's going for another. Not like that, though. Absolute ass. Uh, stoppage time, Chelsea on the cusp of saving a point at Stamford Bridge. There's still a couple of minutes left here for another goal. Miranda, Miranda, Miranda. Oh, that's poor. That's poor Hickam Stoke. Stoke to make it 10. 10 goals in the day. Luongo looks deep. Goes for goal. And it is. It's 10 goals in the day. Gracia, what are you doing? What are you absolutely doing? I can't believe what I'm seeing here. Do not do this, Chelsea. Hold on, Rovers. We've done our bit. Hopefully, uh, Wolves have done their bit. Because after that, after this, we could be in sixth. Dizzy. Six. Six goals. Six spot. Is it true? Let's have a look. And the drum roll. Well, we have to wait. Six goal, Bobby Dazzler. Textera set for goal bonus. He's just one shy of his 15, I think. Ends his goal drought. So ever uh, praise Low Everton's performance. That was probably your best ever uh, best ever performance in the blue and white jersey. Birmingham is there. Let's be taking a closer look at this guy. Not mine, not mine. Moriarty. Where are you, Birmingham City? You're in the championship. You're first in the championship. Well, you want Moriarty? You're going to have to pay... Over 25 million, I think, for that guy. Yeah, the big boys are sniffing. Could be a competition here for him. He's 20, 20 years of age. He must be a he must be a wonder kid. Must be a wonder kid. We'll have a look in a second if he is a wonder kid. Well, let's have a look. I, I didn't see that. It looks like we are six, boys and girls. We are six. We have played the game in hand. Um, and if Chelsea do win that game in hand, they will go back into sixth. But it will leave us with that last game, uh, which will be tomorrow against Chelsea. Winner takes all for six spot. Hopefully they'll do themselves a, a, an absolute travesty and uh, and lose uh, to, to give us a bit of a, a lead. Moriarty, are you a wonder kid? No. Do I have any wonder kids? Do I have any wonder kids in the, in the squad? I should do. We've got a, lot, a bunch of youngsters. No. Maybe we're not good enough. Anyway, that's it, my friends. That is all I've got for you today. Tomorrow, we'll come back for the conclusion uh, game of the, or the games of the season. Everton, we were in a relegation dogfight. We could actually probably relegate Everton. Uh, or could we? No, I think they've actually saved, saved themselves. But I, I think we could drag them right back in the shit, shit zone if they were to lose at Ewood Park. And then we're going to wrap it up with that Bobby Dazzler six-point monster, monster match against Chelsea. Catch it all here. Blackburn Overseas. Make sure you bang the thumbs up, bang the subscribe, and I'll see you all on the other side. Thanks again for watching. Please like, share, and most importantly, hit the subscribe button to keep you bang up to date with all things Blackburn Rovers related, championship related, Football related. We've got it all covered right under one roof. And while I still have you, please be sure to check out some of the old videos scattered along here. I hope.